uh, Granada versus uh, over in La Liga now. Uh, Granada versus Espanol, Martin. My favourite manager's back. Tony, <laughs> doing the offside drill. Come on, lads. Come on. Uh, what a classic bet again. You know, been been back in Granada to lose every week, and they haven't let me down yet. <laughs> Espanol, pretty decent side. They're up in the top half of the table. Okay, they're away from home, but Granada have slipped to bottom of the league, and I think they'll lose again. One point eight three on Espanol. Look very good to me. Wow. Hey, Martin, good. do you think that uh, he will stay with the team also in Serie B? In a, yeah, in a second, in second La Liga? I just can't, I can't believe he will, no. I don't think he will. I think they'll get, I think they'll get rid of him at the end of the season. He will come in Premier League. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, of course. Cool. Awesome yeah. Arsenal's new manager. Yeah, that would be funny. I think, uh, I think yeah. Rochdale might need a new manager after this season. Maybe Rochdale. Maybe Rotter, Rotter, uh, Rotherham, Rotherham even. Rotherham. Rotherham, I'm thinking. Yeah. Rotherham, yeah. That'd be a good okay, place. So I wouldn't get him to manage my son's team, and he's about <laughs> <eight> months old. <laughs> um, Atletico Madrid versus Athletic Bilbao, Martin. I am going for an Atletico Madrid win here at 2.1. Oh, I hate this team. Not a great deal left to play for Atletico, uh, but Atletico Bilbao let me down last weekend. They haven't been in very good form, so I'm going to oppose them here. They've been very good at home all season, but poor on the road. And I think Atletico, just to consolidate that third position, should get a win here. 2.1 on the third best team in La Liga. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the last, uh, the last ever game of the Vicente Calderon, last game, new season, new, season, new stadium. Yeah, it's so a big, it could big, be, big deal. Could be a big one for him. Big deal. I think that uh, I think that Simeone is preparing two great transfers, uh, Matteo and uh, Fellaini <laughs> for, <laughs> for Atletico. Uh, I think Simeone might be looking at Arsenal as his next stop stopover because uh, he may be leaving this summer. I would love it. I would love it. If we Martin, had that, him. That looked like, like an point. orgasm face where you were like. <laughs> 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 make us fight, Simeone. Make us fight. Yeah. Make Tottenham. <laughs> well, I tell you what, though, no, we, I on, think we've got some good transfers happening this window. I think the transfer market is going to be a pretty exciting one uh, this season. Yeah. yeah again, oh, yeah. Mourinho will spend a lot of money on, on crazy players. Uh, I think that first on the list is James Rodriguez, 99%. Uh, the player of Manchester United right now. So yeah. take it from the bench of Real Madrid and bring it to the first team of uh, <laughs> Manchester United. <laughs> been, Probably been joined been by Gareth Bale. Uh, Brighton, that's a big one. <laughs> All right, guys. Celta versus Real Sociedad. Uh, Stuart. Yeah, crazy's back. Let's go for the home win on this one. 4.75 a bet, Victor. Um, Celta actually have the edge on head-to-head -head in these, and uh, even though this does look a bit crazy, home advantage, head-to-head -head edge, I think this one's got a good chance of winning. That's too crazy, I have to say, but let's hear what Alex has got to say. Yeah, I'm playing uh, not crazy. I, I'm playing Real Sociedad <laughs> to win at 1.8. <laughs> Real Sociedad at neck at neck with Athletic Bilbao, and if, uh, if, if Atletico Madrid comes as a winner for Martin. Hopefully, Real Sociedad will uh, jump into the, into the sixth place and qualify in the Europa League. Okay, Martin, did I just see you drinking water there, or is it just a big glass of gin? That's that's straight vodka. <laughs> I'm so surprised. Isn't it against your religion to uh, drink water? Exactly, exactly. No, never. You will never see me drinking water. Definitely not in public. All right. That was so that. That one was uh, yeah, vodka there. All right. Vodka. Honestly. Um, Honestly. Okay, so go, going against each other there. So um, Valencia versus uh, Villarreal, Stuart. Oh come on! Straight back to me again. Again, maybe slightly <laughs> crazy. Home side winner. Uh, Valencia to win again. They do have the edge on the head to head, and I just think these odds are fantastic. Three point one one with Pinnacle. Okay. And uh, last but not least, we've got Malaga versus Real Madrid. And three of you guys are on there. Big man, kick us off. Oh, I'm really digging into the uh, odds on this one, people. Uh, this uh, Real Madrid, I mean, obviously we know they're going to score a ton. And Malaga, not a terrible side. And Real Madrid doesn't keep a ton of clean sheets. But 
you know, I think in the first half, at halftime, I think Real Madrid will have the lead. I don't think Malaga uh, will be able to – Malaga will be able to score. We would say Malaga in this uh, in my area here, uh, but I guess it is Malaga. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, I'm going to go oh, yeah. halftime, Real Madrid, both teams to score no at 1.95. You can find that at Bet365. Malaga. It sounds like pass us Malaga, will you? We have a town here. <laughs> Malaga, so that's not Malaga. There you go. <laughs> that's cool. I've never, heard it, I've never heard it said that before. Malaga. And then, uh, Martin, what are you going for? Malaga versus Real Madrid. I'm not going for Malaga, I'm afraid. I'm going for Real Madrid to win this one. Huge, huge game for Real Madrid. They have to win this one to guarantee that they win La Liga. Right. Ahead of uh, the Tottenham score, Tottenham score. <laughs> 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 Harry Kane is my boy. As if they couldn't get any worse. It's the end of best bets, and Tottenham are winning. Real Madrid have to win this game, and I think they'll come flying out of the blocks. They really need to. Um, says steady the nerves by getting an early goal. So I'm going Real Madrid half time, full time, 1.8. Wow, all right. And uh, Alex, what have you got? I think that Real Madrid can concede uh, against any team that they play against. So Malaga is a really good home side. I fancy Real Madrid to win as they need at least one point from uh, this away game. So Real Madrid and both teams to score at 2.05. Real Madrid and both teams to score. Okay, not bad odds at all. All right, that comes to a close.